Josh, first of all, welcome to Crawley. Uh, some of our fans will remember you because last season yeah. you played twice against us for Northampton, didn't you? Yeah, I can uh, remember towards the end of the season especially. Um, it was a good game, a bit of a battle. Um, but yeah, we came out up on top. Hopefully I can bring the same performance for you guys uh, next season, this season. This season and next season because you yeah. signed an 18-month contract. I guess... Yeah. Um, because the talk at the end of last season was that Northampton were going to keep keep you on and that obviously didn't happen. What's been the story with you since then? Um, yeah, obviously that was kind of unexpected what these things happen in football. Um, since then, I've kind of been to and throwing, not really had any stability as such, keeping myself fit. Um, I ended up returning back to Derby, um, enjoying some good months there. Um, What's that training and keeping yourself yeah, training, over, keeping yeah? fit? I've been playing quite a few games for the 23 side there. Right. Um, yeah, quite a few games there and just enjoyed it and getting myself back in that shop. So I'm kind of ready to get back into the proper football league. It's very cold today. You're rubbing your hands here. Yeah, Actually, you've just cold. been in Sweden as well, haven't you? I bet it was chilly yeah. over there as well. Wasn't yeah, it? it was. It was definitely um, it was definitely an experience in terms of the weather and the football. Um, yeah, I just kind of like to have a look what was what I had to offer there and. Uh, showed a bit of interest, but it just wasn't right for that time. Um, and obviously, I'm, I'm kind of ready for the ready for the challenge here. I was going to say you played a lot of under 23 football, yeah. and at this stage of your career now, it's it's playing regularly in the football league that you need, isn't it? Yeah, I had had a fair, I would say a fair bit last season, um, but I just believe that I need that I need that um, regular starting position I know there's going to be a battle for positions here but I'm ready for it and just that consistent base that I can, um, can go again really I mean it's part of a successful team last season we did very well um, hopefully we can bring it here and finish the season very strong you're down I've seen somewhere as a central defender but you actually you can play right back as well can't yeah, you um, what's your strongest position do you think oh. I would suggest I would say I'd say right back I'm um, I'm more dominant, but also I played centre half quite a lot, and I'm comfortable in that position also. So I'm not really scared of playing either position. And if I'm thrown in there, then I'm sure I'll be able to handle it. And what about Crawley? Do you know any other players here? Or uh, I played James Collins last of course, year. Of course, yeah, last season. Yeah. He was on loan at Northampton. Always um, helps, I guess, when you're coming into a new club. Is it? Yeah. You know, one or two people. Yeah, exactly. But apart from that, I don't know anyone. Personally, but I've got to know the lads already on the first day, and everyone seems brilliant. I mean, the camaraderie between the boys already is something that's showing. So, long may live. A lot of the season left, nearly half the season left, yeah. and still, I think, looking at the table, chance for Crawley to push up and get into those playoff definitely, places. Definitely, definitely. I mean, when the uh, when the interest came through, I looked at the league table after a few hours, and I was pleasantly surprised. I was thinking, in league in league football, you never know what can happen. I mean five points off playoffs, a couple of games in hand, you're looking at it thinking you're in a strong position and anything can happen, you know, string a few results together, you're going to be right in amongst it, so looking forward to it.